welcome back to my channel. This is Batel from Adele's Kitchen and today we're going to make the most amazing roasted potatoes on the planet. They're absolutely addictive. These are going to be a beautiful, beautiful side dish for any occasion, for any meal, for any holiday or Shabbat. They're just going to be so perfect with any meal you're going to serve them. My family, my kids, my husband are absolutely obsessed with them. They're so irresistible and they have tons of garlic and herbs that makes them really healthy and so delicious. If you're new over here, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I post a new recipe every single week. And all the measurements for this recipe are going to be in the description box below or on my website, bucktailskitchen.com. Okay guys, let's get started. So I am picking today a Yukon Gold Potatoes, which are my favorite by far. So we're just gonna take those Yukon Gold Potatoes and we're gonna cut them in half. And then each half, we're gonna cut either to two or three wedges, depending on the size of the potato. So all you have to do is run through the knife from the angle and cut them into three and get the favorite wedges that you love. Now, in terms of the herbs, I love using fresh herbs. You can use the dry ones if you want, but the fresh ones are much more potent and much more flavorful. And also they have a tremendous amount of health benefits. So I'm using rosemary, which has this amazing benefit of increasing memory and concentration. I am also using a fresh thyme, and this is optional. You can use either or. You can use only fresh thyme or only fresh rosemary but i have both today on hand so i'm using both and i want to tell you that the flavor is insane another benefit of thyme is the iron thyme has a really nice amount of iron so you can really increase the level of irons for your family we're also going to chop a ton of fresh garlic and you guys notice that i'm using fresh ingredients and not dry ingredients today i feel like they make the difference over here so we're using all this garlic and we're using salt and pepper and a nice drizzle of extra virgin olive oil and we're going to use our hands in order to mix everything to the best consistency possible we're going to layer everything on a flat baking sheet lined with parchment paper and we're going to put it in the oven on a roast feature we're going to put them not on a very high heat because we want to make sure they're cooked through in the inside we want to get them really 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 creamy so i'm putting these potatoes on 375 fahrenheit on a roast feature if you do not have the roast feature you can use a bake feature on 400 just make sure that they're cooked through if your oven is too high lower it to 375 as well so we want to get them really really sizzling you can mix them halfway through you don't have to if you feel like you need to use a spatula and move them carefully but these potatoes are basically ready and they are insanely delicious i cannot even describe to you guys and i'm specifically making a very big quantity because my kids cannot get over them especially my husband he can eat a whole tray of them alone also myself now in terms of the garnishing i'm just garnishing everything with a little bit of more fresh herbs so that everybody know that this is what we have in terms of the flavors and these potatoes are ready to be devoured you can really use any dipping or no dipping at all i'm doing a little bit of low sugar organic ketchup you can skip it if you want you can really use them as a side dish for your protein you can really just eat them with a fresh salad you can enjoy them as a snack you can take them to work you can do whatever you want i can just tell you that they're really irresistible there's not much that is going to be left from them I hope you guys are going to enjoy all these really humble ingredients that are so easy to reach. You can get them anywhere. They're not complicated to use. They're very simple and they're extremely, extremely beneficial for our overall health. Thank you guys for watching today and I will see you in the next video. That's it for today, my friends. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're going to give this recipe a try. If you did, don't forget to let me know in the comments below. And if you need some more help with eating more plant-based, 
check out my cookbook, Eggless Possibilities, where you can find so many meals that the whole family can enjoy. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. And if you enjoyed today's content, consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you guys, I'll see you later.